Oh, I was, I was really excited for the family. Actually, there was another story before that one where somebody else was rec um, rescued um, who had traveled out of the country. So any story like this really, really builds um, on my continued hope for my daughter. As Elvia keeps in close contact with investigators and Sheriff Leon Lott, she says she believes the investigation is progressing, that leads are still coming in. I would hate I would just hate for someone to give up and she's still out there waiting and praying for someone to rescue her and bring her home just like these three girls. Elvia is not the only one still holding out hope. Community members say they have not forgotten about Gabby or little Amir Jennings, the one-year-old Columbia boy who vanished without a trace a year and a half ago. I'm hoping they find uh, the little boy and Gabby because that my heart goes out to the uh, you know family members. For it being this long, I, I'm pretty sure they feel like they lost hope. So I think that's the watching the news and feel like that to give a sense of hope and get them back out there and trying to find out some more information. That's a mother's worst fear is losing her babies. But until the answers come, Elvia continues to focus on staying positive and praying lots. I'm not giving up on my daughter. I'm not giving up on Gabby. And um, hopefully if she can hear me or see me on the news or anything, hopefully um, um, I'm praying that she could stay strong, 